Thomas Weather. The Rich Thomas Weather Network, brought to you by these fine sponsors. Hear Rich's forecast hourly on these Blue Water Broadcasting Radio stations. Hey, good morning, everybody. Thursday morning, it is Friday Eve. It is also the uh, summer solstice day. It is officially spring right now as I make this at 4.14 a.m. With a temperature of 70 degrees and a dew point of 65. That's not bad. That's very reasonable. Uh, summer beginning in about a little shy of 12 hours at 3.51 p.m. Longest day of the year. Yeah, I mean, it's one second longer than yesterday. And tomorrow, Friday, is one second shorter than today. All right, so, you know, yesterday was uh, very reasonable with 89 degrees, dew points in the mid-60s, and a heat index below 100. I think the heat index will be below 100 today. I've got us a little higher. I've got us around 94 for a high temperature today, but the dew points will be in the mid-60s. So all things considered, not bad. When you look at what's happening in other parts of the country, with extreme heat in some places, wildfires in other places, uh, tropical rains in Texas. Um, when you look at what's happening elsewhere, our weather is actually pretty good. And I don't see any problems here in the next few days. Today, I've got the rain chances again, today and tomorrow, 10% or less. Could there be a shower on the radar? Yeah, I suppose. But as you'll see on future radar below, the rain chances are minuscule today maybe a little better over the weekend. We'll put in a small 20% chance of uh, random storms as tropical moisture invades the area as we get into Saturday and Sunday, but still a pretty routine forecast. Now, temperatures will start edging upward. We'll be probably closer to the upper 90s, maybe by uh, Sunday and certainly Monday, Tuesday as well. In the tropics, we have Tropical Storm Alberto about to make landfall this morning. As of 4 o'clock a little while ago here, as I make this, uh, it is 40 miles from Tampico, Mexico, uh, moving off to the, the west <clears throat> at about 13 miles per hour with winds of 50 miles per hour. But most of the weather with Alberto is farther to the north, so tropical storm force winds are still battering south Texas and uh, also a lot of rainfall. And right behind Alberto is another area to watch in the same neighborhood. Um, it's coming off of um, the Yucatan right now. And this system has a, a decent chance of developing and maybe becoming Tropical Storm Burl. So maybe right on the heels of Alberto in the same neighborhood in the southwestern Gulf of Mexico, maybe another tropical storm with a name. All right. Also off the southeast coast, we still have that area to watch. It's kind of like a tropical wave and it's moving towards the southeastern U.S. coastline, 30% chance of that developing. But that's also going to be what's going to return our tropical moisture to our area, to our neighborhood, uh, over the upcoming weekend. Otherwise, there's nothing else to talk about, and I love it. I love it. Uh, so I hope you have a great first day of summer. Welcome to summer, the summer solstice. Uh, today, everything is normal, including... Live on the radio, 6 to 9 on News Talk 93.1 WACV. You'll find my forecast discussion video, which is what this is, and also our blog update with all the graphics in the 4 o'clock hour tomorrow morning, and your forecast whenever you want it. Across the dial on eight radio stations every day of the year. That is uh, the Blue Water family of stations. Hat, welcome to summer. We'll, well, we're a few hours away, but welcome to summer anyway. Have a good one. See you. Thomas Weather.